we Gemini Marine. Uh, we specialize in building customer specific niche uh, rigid inflatable boats as well as fully inflatable boats. Uh, we've been established in uh, 1979 and been exporting for over 25 years to 40 odd countries. We've got a very dedicated staff. Some of the guys have been with us for over 20 odd years. Uh, our three directors have been with us since the beginning basically. Jeff Stevens, the founding member, is still one of our directors, technical director and on the design side of things, research and design. We do all our own in-house design. Um, everything's hand-built as you can see. So, so the production process, we ISO 9001 2008 qualified and certified. So we've got a quality management system in place which is internationally recognized that we built the boats to. Our basic focus lies in the niche markets. We build racing boats, recreational boats, rescue, commercial and military boats. So whatever the application, we're certain we've got a boat that will be able to meet the customer's needs. The reason for Gemini was that um, in, the, in NATO, they had a boat that they called Gemini for whatever reason. Um, and eventually I found out that Gemini is um, in Roman mythology, there are two brothers, Castor and Pollux, and they're the rescuers of the sea in Roman mythology. So um, that was Gemini. And people, and I called it that because when I worked at Dunlop, I used to build the NATO, the NATO spec, NATO issue Gemini boat. And then I thought, I'll call it Gemini because there's so many people that identify with it. You'd meet people and they'd say, mm, so what do you do? And they're a doctor, a lawyer, a dustman, whatever. And they'd say, what do you do? And I said, well, I'm building inflatable boats. Inflatable boats. Oh yeah, like the kids using the bars. No, no, they're much bigger. Oh, like you get two kids in with a pair of oars. No, much bigger. In, in a Sarai, I use them. Yeah, right. You know, they couldn't conceive of what an inflatable boat looked like. In the mid-80s, 84, 85, we started the inflatable boat racing scene. And it exploded. Within a couple of years, wherever you went in South Africa, in December or Easter, you just saw rubber ducks, which is what they called them and it, was, it had flooded the country. What makes us different to, the, to our competitors is that we design up to a quality, not down to a price, whereas the others are how much they can save you know, and make the thinnest, the cheapest, the lightest, the whatever, and just barely scrape through. We decided long ago, right from the beginning, we're going to go up. We're going to see what is the best boat we can possibly build. And having Enesara as your first customer, you know, you had to be building a boat that was better than the rest because when every, all the other boats were scurrying for shelter, our boats would be going out to rescue those that weren't making it. So that was the inspiration and we've kind of stuck to that ethos ever since because we really had to make sure that our boats were 100%, 100% reliable, 100% seaworthy, that anybody could drive it because you never know who might be in a really critical situation. The boat has to be seriously easy to drive. Doesn't matter what you do with our boats, you won't put a foot wrong. They don't nose, they don't nose dive, they don't bow steer, they don't go all over the place, they just go dead straight. Very predictable indeed. Very soft ride um, and very, very strong. But being as light as possible at the same time. We've got a couple of records in place. Uh, obviously it's very seasonal, so it goes different conditions, flat water racing to surf racing. Uh, our boats are uh, all, we like to see it as an all-rounder, so it's good in all conditions, but the Gemini specifically likes rough water. Um, so that's where we, our boats perform the best, definitely. From the international trends that we see, uh, it definitely looks like bigger is better. 
uh, hence why we've developed the new Gemini Wave Rider 1050 and we've got lots of pre-orders in place so it looks to be a very popular model that people are looking for. The bigger the boat it can go deeper waters, it can patrol bigger areas and it can carry more crew so it also gives you that aspect of safety.